You're welcome to Green Nigeria. Okay, you're welcome to your number one unauthentic program on radio. It's Green Nigeria Radio Show. And today we'll be telling you about Zamfara State. We'll be telling you the origin of that state and we'll be telling you the governor of that state and what he's doing in terms of tourism and agriculture. And um, we'll just give you some tourism news again as usual on the program. It's Green Nigeria Radio Show and it's the show that promotes Nigeria and the states in Nigeria and it's this, it's it's that number one and authentic program on tourism and agriculture that talks about um, the unity of our country and tries to bring back the history of our country and um, helps us to understand the culture and tourism sites of each state better okay hang on and we'll be bringing you zamfara state after which we'll bring you agricultural news and we'll just wrap it up from there it's green nigeria radio show it's tourism agriculture progress and my name is meshak yage you're welcome to green nigeria <laughs> Okay, Zamfara Kingdom was established in the 11th century and flourished up to 16th century as a city state. Okay? On 1st October 1996, Zamfara State was created. Okay? On the 1st of October 1996, Zanfara State was created. And of course, the capital is Gusau. What you can find in Zanfara State will be giving you that uh, immediately, okay? And what the governor is doing in that state as well. Okay, now on to more news concerning Zanfara. Uh, we'll tell you that Governor Dauda Lawal of Zanfara State has uh, started. Um, I mean, he stated that his administration's commitment to provide employment opportunities to over 40,000 uh, farmers is still reaffirmed. So you will know that the governor of Zamfara State is actually doing big things, making big moves to make sure that farmers are well catered for. And of course, if you cater for the farmers, and security and all that, um, and pro providing tractors and, and fertilizers, you know that you have secured the future in terms of food security. So big ups to the governor of Zamfara State. And to other news concerning food security in Zamfara, um, the governor has launched more uh, you know, arsenal against uh, food secure, food insecurity, okay? So now, on to other news. Governor Daudi Lawal of Zamfara State has emphasized the importance of agriculture to Zamfara State's economy, okay? He has you know, emphasized the importance of agriculture to the Zamfara State's economy. He has also said he will revamp agriculture, so we just wait for his... Uh, fulfillment of promises um, and we'll see how it goes. We'll be giving you more on Zamfara State as events unfold in that state concerning agriculture and tourism. Of course, you know that Zamfara State has gold. Are you aware that there's gold in Zamfara State? Are you aware that they have a lot of maize? They have a lot of uh, you know, food items that you can go to Zamfara State and get and bring down to other places like maybe Abuja or Potakot or Lagos and you just become a major supplier of this food uh, items. Okay, so check Zamfara State out and give us your feedback. This is Green Nigeria Radio Show. Let's just go to our agricultural news. We'll see what is happening in other states of the country and we'll be right back. It's Green Nigeria Radio Show and Meshak Yagi. That's all that we can give you for today's program on Green Nigeria Radio Show. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share if you have enjoyed today's episode. And of course, don't forget we always say here on Agri here on Green Nigeria Radio Show, it's about tourism, agriculture, progress. 
God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria. And of course, we say a shout out to the Executive Governor of Zamfara State and we say God bless His Excellency Governor Dauda Lawal. <laughs> You're welcome to Green Nigeria. <laughs>